Hello. Hello, Ms. Yes. Hi, this is Danny Ray with insuranceforburial.com. How are you, ma'am? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing good, doing good. I um, just want to talk, and um, I did try to reach out to you a couple weeks back, and I think my wife, Lisa Marie, as well, okay, to try to get you taken care of. I was, <clears throat> I was trying to change banks, and okay, uh, wasn't quite ready to get into all that, but anyway, okay. now I am. All right, good, good. Okay. <laughs> Um, so again, first and foremost, I just got to let you know I'm the license agent in the state of Iowa. They make me say that. Okay. All right. All right. So, um, what I'm going to do, I'll tell you how the process works. Um, right now I know you want to get day one coverage. Okay. So there's no waiting period. Okay. The only option that we do have is family benefit life. All right. Um, and other than that, the plan B would be mutual of all migrated. So we're going to try. I'm really not opposed to, you know, like a, one year or something. Okay. Uh, yeah, well, but this is what we'll do. There's I mean, nothing really, I mean, you know, I do have diabetes, but yeah. it's under control. I, my A1C was 5.5. Okay. Which um, is in the normal range. So, all right. you know, um, there's no reason to believe I'm, unless there's an accident. I believe that I'll pass in the next two years, but you know, it's, it's, yeah. it's hard to say that I won't. No, I totally understand. And you know, here we, we we ultimately try to do. We want to get you the best product. That's what we really want to do. And Plan B would be one of those other products, the one year rating period, things of that nature. Mm -hmm. Because um, looking at your medication list, okay, we'll go over that briefly, so I make sure I don't leave anything out. Um, the biggest challenge with this is the gabapentin with diabetic medication because most insurance companies will just automatically assume diabetic neuropathy, okay, no matter what you say. Even if you didn't have it, they say it's a combination. That's usually what happens. So they'll give you a graded on the spot. However, there are carriers out there that specialize in this, on family benefit being one of them, which if you have neuropathy, you're okay, okay? Royal Neighbors is another one. They're just not good in Alabama, okay? We'd be going I do have neuropathy. Yeah. Yes. I so, used to fall a lot, and okay. I know that the neuropathy is in my uh, uh, lower legs and feet. Okay. Yeah, so that's so when you have the gabapentin, okay, for the nerve damage, that's what they look at. So a lot of carriers will just give you a graded waiting period policy because of that. Because, mm -hmm. uh, you know, obviously just, they go based off everything on statistics. So what we always try to do first is stick with the ones that have the best option for you to get day one coverage. Mm -hmm. In this case, um, family benefit life would be the best one. Uh, and I'm a big, I'm the biggest believer. You miss a hundred percent of the shots you don't take. Okay. So that would be the best option for you to get day one. What coverage. do you mean? The hundred percent of the shots you don't take. If we I don't, don't take understand that. Oh, I'll explain it. So if you go ahead, if we don't, if we just go, you know what, when I get a shot with family benefit, then you're not going to get the opportunity to actually get that day one coverage where this is the only carry that possibly will give you that. So if you don't even try, Okay, and I think we've got about a 90% chance of getting approved with them on that day one coverage. Um, it's, it's definitely worth the try because, again, it's 98 bucks a month. It's below 100. It's the only one under 100. And the next one above that is 134. So that's almost like 35% uh -huh. more. You know what I mean? So we want to make sure that you right. get the best price. And, but most importantly, make sure that you get the, you know, the best coverage available to you if you're, if you're able to. I uh, was looking for something below 100 or right at 100. Yeah, so I mean, if we go and how much coverage is this? That's a good question. It's sixteen thousand would get you okay. just a hundred bucks. Okay, now let's just say family benefit turns us down, and again, I wouldn't even try if I didn't have a shred of doubt knowing that you get approved. Okay, I'm not one of those guys who like to throw stuff against the wall. All right, so if let's just say they say no, you know what, we're going to offer a graded policy, then we'll go that route where we can get a one year waiting period with possibly GTL. Okay, if we go that route. And that's a plan B, okay? I always like to give you some options. Um, but if we go that route, you're looking at uh, the, the stay under 100 bucks, um, or right around $100, we'd have to drop that coverage down to 12 if that does happen, all right? But mm -hmm. again, I like to be very transparent to give you your options. So I really believe that the 16000 with family benefit is the best option first, okay? We do have a shot of getting that, all right? And this People, is a whole life, uh, and it yes. can't be canceled. Does yes. the 
uh, uh, premium go up? That's a great question. The premiums never go up. The coverage never gets cut, unlike you know colonial pens, your globes of the world. Yeah, this is a this is a legitimate simplified issue of whole life policy where none of that. Well, colonial like, pen says well. it never goes up, but. It, it, well, Colonial Pen, it never goes up, but the insurance goes down. <laughs> yeah, so they're right, <laughs> on, right on that theory, right? The 995 plan, you believe me, that 995 plan, I replace the top three policies I replace for seniors over 75, and you're almost there. My mother looked into that when she, uh, when they, uh, when she was diagnosed with cancer. Yeah. And uh, she said that. The nine ninety five was for a thousand dollars. Yes. And uh, now it's eight eighty. So <laughs> it goes down. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, it goes down. So it's. Uh, but this one right here, this will never go down on you. This as long as you make your premium payments, policy never goes down. As far as the coverage, payments never stay up its level across the board. All right. Okay. So. All right, so I'm just going to go over your medication to make sure I'm not leaving anything out. Okay, I, I like to be very, right, very thorough. Up. Sure. Let me let me pull up my list. Okay, take your time, dear. Oh shoot! First of all, I need to put you on speakerphone. Okay. Okay, now you're on speakerphone. Okay. <laughs> I forgot to do that. <laughs> okay, I have quite a list. That's okay. That's most importantly. We'll go. We'll go one all. I just no, not that okay. I know of. All right. So no complications. Okay. And when did you start taking that? When was the when did you start start taking oh, Approx God. approximate years? It's only been a couple of years. Okay, so maybe 2019 about. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. And it's controlled. Okay. Nambutone. Nambutone. Okay. How do you spell that, dear? N-A-M-B-U-T-O-N-E. That's for arthritis. It's an anti-inflammatory. Okay. And I just want to make sure it's on the list. And spell that slowly one more time, dear. Oh, I got it right here. Nambutone. Got it. Okay. And that's for a psoriatic arthritis? Not rheumatoid, right? No, it's not rheumatoid. Okay. But it's and not psoriatic either. It's just regular old arthritis. Gotcha. Okay. It's in my hands. <laughs> gotcha. Okay. Got a lot of pain in my hands. Oh. <clears throat> then the gabapentin. Gabapentin. Got that. You're current with that. It's for the diabetic neuropathy nerves. Okay. 600, 600 milligrams twice a day. Okay, let me just double check to see if they're going to look at any. So it's a diabetic neuropathy. Okay, and when did you start taking that, dear? How many years ago? That's been about five or six years, I guess. All right, so I'll put down about 2016, right around there. Okay. Okay, okay. and what's your next one, dear? Potassium chloride. Okay, that's more of a supplement, right? Yes. Okay, that's fine. Paxil. Got that. And when did you start taking the Paxil? Yeah. Oh, gosh. Forever. Okay. And is that for the, do you have anxiety disorder, depression, OCD? Depression. Depression. Okay. And you're currently taking that. Magnesium and, outside. Okay. Magnesium. Okay. Uh, Algopurinol. That's for the for gout, gout, right? Yep. Got it. Okay. Prevastatin for cholesterol. How you pure and all? Which my life checkup was perfect. Pure and all. Levothyroxin for thyroid. Got that. Levothyroxin got it. Okay. Um, I take uh, oxycodone, acetaminophen, seven point five, three twenty five. Now is that for pain or chronic? Was that for pain or chronic pain? Well, I don't know the difference, so yeah, you know, I don't you know. probably you probably got thick skin, right? You've been doing it so long; it just it's just something you maintain. All right, I'll put down I'll put down chronic pain for now, and and, and I have um, I have um, 
uh, bulging discs in my oh. neck and in my lower back, and then okay. I have a, a, a. I'm trying to think of the words. One of my discs is. Oh, gosh, I can't think of the word. I'll think of it later. That's okay. That's all right. Like degenerative? degenerative. um, That wasn't a word. Okay. So it's just the uh, bulging discs. My mom had that. I can can't think of the word. Yeah, my mom but has But it'll that. come to me. That's okay. Um, I take Claritin. They, the rest of these are supplements. Okay, gotcha. All right. So Multivitamins, the... uh, okay. Claritin, vitamin D3. Okay. Um, melatonin, calcium. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So basically, okay. So, um, so you got the let me just the, the so basic prescriptions. I got the Losartan, the Prevostatin for the cholesterol, level thyroxine for the thyroid, metformin for the diabetes, the Nebutone for the arthritis, uh, the Gabapentin for the diabetic neuropathy, got the Paxil for the depression, uh, the magnesium oxide, okay for heartburn, uh, oxycodone for pain, all right, and also allopurinol for gout. That's pretty much all the prescriptions, right? And all, all everything else is pretty much potassium chloride. Let me see. Okay, potassium. Let's see, um, hang on one second here. Just want to let's see what I have. I have a proprietary system that I put all this stuff through, and I thought of the name of that. Um, Bulging discs. I have a compression fracture of my lower back in my oh, lower back. That's rough. Okay. I've got four bulging discs in my neck. Ooh, that hurts. That's you know, why my mother. I'm on yeah, my mom was a my mom was a nurse for thirty three years. My mom was small, five foot two, and she worked at a at a psychiatric center, Kings Park Psychiatric Center at Long Island. And she's a small little lady, but it was a psych ward, right? So she used to, she worked there for 33 years. And, you know, psych patients are strong. They throw people around, right? My little old mom, you know, um, she used to come home pretty banged up. And she had bulging discs because of that, uh, an inverted neck because she had a neck injury once. So I totally understand. My mom used to, you get pain to the, you get numb to the pain, you know, after a while, you just live with it, and it's you don't even know if it's chronic or it's pain. You just know it's it's it, it's it doesn't feel good, <laughs> you know. Uh, so I totally I, sit down. My back starts hurting. I have to sit down. Yeah. And I sit down a little while, about as long as I stood up, and then I'm back to working again. Yeah. <laughs> just have done it that way for so long. I. Didn't know any other way to do it. <laughs> no, I understand. I totally understand this care. Um, you just gotta, you know, you just gotta roll with the punches, you know. You know, do the yeah. best you can. You gotta do the best you can. You just um, have to do, deal with what God gave you. That's it. That's it. You know, and um, and just uh, if you're gonna fall, fall forward, right? What's the old saying? Fall forward. Yeah. All right, dear. With all the medications, uh, family benefits are a bet. We're gonna give, take a shot, okay? Um, Sixteen thousand for ninety-eight dollars and ten cents. So let me tell you how the process is gonna work, okay? I'm gonna take the application right over the phone, as if you and I are sitting with each other right at your kitchen table, okay? Then what I'm gonna do for you is I'm gonna go over the exact questions because this is a voice signature. Okay, so basically, once I get the application information, we do a three-way with the insurance company, okay? And you'll hear them verify your information, like your, your date of birth, your, you know, your uh, social security number, your where the policy is being mailed to, your beneficiaries, stuff like that. They, they Pretty much the stuff that's on the application. 
Then they're going to ask to speak to you. And they're going to ask you health questions. But before we get on the phone with them, I'm going to ask you the exact health questions that they're going to ask you so you're prepared, so you know exactly what's coming, okay? Uh, and because I, and then another reason why I do that is because some of these questions, you know these insurance companies, some of these questions, you know, some of these are a little tricky, right? So you need to go over the questions to, to understand what they're really asking you, okay? But um, lo and behold, within the next 20 minutes, you'll be off the phone with an approved policy, okay? That's the most important thing. Okay. Um, do you have any questions before we get started? No. All right. And uh, what I did, went ahead and did for you is <laughs> I emailed you back on the 8th. I'm going to forward you that email. Let me tell you what's in that email. It's the quote and also the brochure, but also it's the disclosure form. They're going to ask if I sent that to you. Okay. Let me explain to you what the disclosure form is. Okay. It basically t lets them know that you are aware that you're applying for life insurance and you know they're going to go ahead and look at your MIB report and your prescription history. Okay, that's what My they do. What report? Okay. You're, it's called an MIB report, meaning Medical Information Bureau. Okay, so what they do is they do a MIB report poll. And what it is, it's like they're codes. Now, if you ever had a heart attack, they're going to see a code for heart attack. If you ever had a stroke, they're going to see a code for stroke, stuff like that. All right, so, and, and, and any of those okay if it's more than two years ago. OK, so they'll do an MIB search. It takes it do it electronically. It's done in like a second. OK, and they do a prescription history based off your Social Security number. So they do your script history, which, again, all this stuff happens within seconds. OK, but the disclosure form I have to send you. OK, because by law, I have to. OK, so if they ask you that your your uh, did your agent go ahead and send you the, the disclosure forms. Now you can say yes, because it's sitting in your inbox as we speak. OK, your email. All right. So I got that okay. over to you. All right, dear. And okay, so uh, let me just verify your address. Uh, it is x a n s c e e c e e at gmail dot com. Say that again. Pardon. Hey, yes, I think. So I just, just I just always put down. If I don't know your date of birth, I always put yeah, Tennessee River, right? That's what you're near, right over there. Right. Ah, oh, you're near. Oh, wow, you're near the. Um, now, I drove to Memphis uh, back a couple of years ago, and we drove up through Georgia and a little bit of Alabama. We went to uh, – what is that place called? It's, in a, it's, it's outside of Chattanooga, maybe. I think it, I think it might be that. Um, where you can see seven states at the same time. You're up in a mountain, and you can see literally Virginia, North Carolina, the Carolinas, Florida. I can't remember what it was. Beautiful. But you're up there and you're, 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 you're literally out in this little balcony off the mountain. And you can, if you look all the way to you, you can see Virginia, um, North Carolina, the seven states you can see from that far up. North Carolina, the Carolinas, Georgia, obviously Alabama, um, Tennessee. And I th yeah, it's like, I think it's six or seven states. Beautiful. I got, I picked, I got a picture of my wife standing out there with a cowboy, a cowboy hat on. And then we put a, um, Nice <laughs> quote. We have to hang it up in the. Yeah, I'll send you the picture of her. Yeah. <laughs> Insurance company ever declined. You know, I want to be completely truthful. Absolutely. And that's, we slash our T's dot our I's, okay? And, and that's why you're going to get exactly, that's why I'm very thorough with this, because it doesn't make any sense to do any other way, okay? Um, and has any life insurance company ever declined? And what's your son's name? So they make more money off your money. 19, 1970. All right. And. It's a check. It's a checking account. You, but um, do you have a pen? I have here? it. All right. At eight. Little important stuff that they might ask you to verify, uh, like you know who's your beneficiary. Okay. <laughs> and you're gonna get a kick out of some of these questions. So if you that one made you laugh, you're gonna be in stitches after we're done. Okay. <laughs> um, have you? Second one is have you have you been diagnosed or treated? I don't know what cardiomyopathy. The average person. Women live to be 80, 81, us guys, 76, 77. But if you have any of these important health issues or health impairments, your mortality statistically drops drastically. Like somebody with Down syndrome, um, that's why they, they these are the, the number of the, these first few questions are knockout questions. Okay. Okay. All right. And, okay, so we got over that one. The next question is, are you currently, by a medical profession, been advised? To okay, beautiful. All right. Part B, this is the next couple of questions. You're doing great. Have you ever... No. Like, verify your social security number. Um, do you have any questions for me, dear, before we get started? No. 
Okay, good. Just bear with me one second. And again, I just want to go ahead and make sure I got that up. And again, your date of birth is December. You have reached the Trinity Life and Family Benefit tele-interview line. Please stay on the line for the next available representative. Thank you for calling Trinity Life and Family Benefit. And the music might drive you crazy. <laughs> yes, hi. Yes, how are you doing? My name is... Great niece. Can we see issued as a result of this application? Yes. Authorization for the leg notice. I agree that FBLIC... And we are finished with your portion of the interview. Thank you so much up with Mr. Ray. And I'm pretty sure he has a few things he would like to talk to you about. And I'll now take your voice signature. Future, please state your name and happy to help you out, sir. Thank you. Have a great Thank day, Thank you. Right? Bye-bye. Right. You too. Thank Bye-bye. you. Well, congrats. Processing portion of it. Oh, the, pay- the payment processing part? Yeah. Let me explain that to you very slowly, okay? Um, you, have an, you have an option. I mean, the way to pay for this, okay, you can have it immediate, which is now, today, where you have coverage. And you usually see that payment come out within, within a couple of days. Or you can pick a due date, okay? A lot of clients go off of Social Security billing, okay, which, which could be the third Wednesday of the month, the second Wednesday of the month, okay? Um, some clients get their Social Security checks on the third. Or you can do standard, which is a date that you pick. OK, so if it's immediate, that means you're, you're you're pretty much paying for the policy for the next couple of days. So you'll see ninety eight dollars come out of your account in the next couple of days. OK, and then going forward, the due date will be on the 28th. OK, so it's always going to be a month away. Right. All right. So it's never going to be double billed. Security. I get my Social Security on the third Wednesday. So. There's no way of telling what date that's going to be, so I chose. Yeah. To so that that's which is smart because you know exactly the 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 worst it can get is to, I guess the 26th or the 27th, right? Um, we do that a lot. Mm-hmm. But if you want me to tell them the third Wednesday of the month or the fourth, I'm sorry, the fourth Wednesday of the month. You said the third Wednesday, right? Um, yeah. yeah. If it's the third Wednesday of the month, we can make it so they have a they have what's called Social Security billing. So no matter when that third day, uh, Wednesday of the month is, it'll come out that day. doesn't matter That's if the 20th is the 20th. We can, I can call up and have them switch it, or you can leave it on the 28th. Whatever's good for you. We'll leave it on the 28th. All right. And if you ever want to have any changes, call me. Your mode of payment, okay, uh, the date, you always call me, okay, because I'll tell you why. You're my client, okay, so you're like family, okay. Uh, my lovely wife, Lisa Marie. If you ever speak to her, you're probably never going to want to speak to me again. <laughs> She's so sweet. But uh, no, all kidding aside, if you ever need anything done, call me. Remember, we work for you, not the insurance company. Okay, so anything you ever need, call us first. If you ever need to change anything, give us a call because we can have it to you in two minutes via email, where in some cases, when you call an insurance company, you might get somebody on the phone in customer service that's you're just a disembodied voice over the phone, right? So instead of you being put on hold and everything else, just call us and we have 99% of the things you need from the insurance company we can give to you in a very quick and efficient manner, okay? Um, But again, if you ever need anything, please do not even hesitate, okay, to call us. Okay. All right. Do you have any questions for me, dear, at all? I think we covered just about everything. <laughs> All right, good, good. I know it took a little bit, a little longer than expected, but the most important thing is you got exactly what you deserve, and we didn't take anything less than what you deserve. That's the most important thing, and you got day okay. one coverage. All right, dear. All right. Thank All right, you. You're welcome. No problem. And what I'll do for you too, okay, because biggest things to us is our clients telling, and giving us good feedback. Okay. Um, what I'm going to do for you is I'm going to send you an email with the rate. The, the product brochure, I think I already sent that to you last a couple of weeks ago, but I'm going to send you over an email with a review, okay? So you can do a trust pilot review. Just be honest with us because, again, it helps us be better for the next client, okay? So um, if you can leave us a review, that would be wonderful. I'll send you over that email for the review, okay? Okay. All right, yeah. And, and again, anything you need, don't even hesitate to call me. Welcome aboard.